Chapter 8 The Wish Though usually quite cheery, one day the girl became sad again. Lumos drew close and tried to comfort her. Mama, you still have me. And don't be sad about you, Mama, because she's part of you. That means she's always close by. It's like me. I love Starbucks because they remind me of my Mama. No, no, the girl said, unable to stop the tears. The lonely be look flickered across Lumos' face. But it was soon replaced by a wide grin. I have an idea! I will transform into a comet, and soaring comet that can carry you all on this journey. With that Luma, trailing bonds of light soared high into the sky, and just as quickly started to plummet back down. Kaboom! Kablam! The ground shook and a bright light poured out of the crater that the Luma had created. The bonds of light twisted together to form a comet trail. And then, com Luma, not comet, emerged, reborn as a comet. The girl could scarcely believe her eyes. But how? she kept asking. Our destiny as Lumas is to transform into different things, said a red Luma who had suddenly appeared. Stars, comets, planets, we can become all of those things. When I grow up, I want to become a star that makes someone special smile, said the green Luma. The blue Luma chimed in. That Luma turned into a real cutie of a comet, didn't he? Isn't that just adorable? All of the Lumas together said, No more crying, Mama. Thank you, said the girl in a whisper, and she pulled the Lumas close and hugged them. From that day on, Starbits no longer fell from the girl's eyes. The comet set forth for the girl's home planet, its long tail blazing proudly behind it. Final Chapter Family With its many lumas and telescopes, the comet was quite a sight to behold. The girl and the lumas were proud to call it home. At a welcoming party for a new luma, the girl gathered everyone in the kitchen and said in a louder voice than usual, All right, everyone, let's make a cake. A cake sprinkled with star bits. And then it will be a star cake. The lumas excitedly began to gather their ingredients. As, he wa as she watched the Luma scurry about, the girl smiled and thought to herself, This is my family now, and I will stay with them until they're ready to leave the nest. And when they do leave, I will see them off with a smile. Because that's what makes a mother happiest. That night, when the girl lay down to sleep, a soft light enveloped her and reminded her of the blue planet she once called home. But it would be nice to return home every one, once every 100 years to nap in my favorite sleeping nook. The comet carrying the Lumas and the girl continues on its journey to this very day. With more family number. I said numbers, members in tow that can be counted. It's said that the comet visits the girl's home planet once every 100 years. It's proud white tail glittering in the sky. The end. Now, that story, I'm going to tell you in surprise, that was a story about Luma. That, ah, sorry, 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 sorry. That was not what the story was about. It was about Rosalina in her youth. I'm, I don't say that it was about Luma in her, in her youth. But really, it was about Rosalina in her youth. Yeah. Imagine how old Rosalina is now. Is she like 200 years old but still remains young? Or is she still young and hasn't met her home planet yet? That's why I always younger. 
I mean wonder. Man, I really wish I had a better fit. So that's the end of the story, everyone. My story is finished. Now, what we're gonna do is I'm gonna show you what would happen if you get all 9,999 star bits. Eh -eh. I do not want to go to the Wii menu. I want to go to the reset software button. Yeah, my battery's about to die soon, but I won't die yet. So this is the file where I collected all of the star bits. This is the one that I just started. This is the one I completed. Almost there though. That is surprising. And this is what I just started that I just showed you guys. So let's check the icons. This is my icons. There's only one page of them. Mario, Luigi, Yoshi, Toad, and Peach, along with your Miis. I was planning to do my Luigi Mii, because, of course, it's Super Luigi Galaxy. For the first file, that is. I just wanted it to be Luigi. So, this is with 9,999 Starbits. I... wait. I'm actually gonna go to the garden. Actually, I came the right way. Because I'm gonna fly. And, and as much as this may surprise you, but I'm gonna keep playing in this file. You know why? Since I completed my file in Super Luigi Galaxy, why not? I'm gonna do this file. So that I'll try to do the head starts in the Honey Hive Galaxy. So... The Deep Dark Galaxy is the, is the closest galaxy to the surprise as it is. Remember the watermelon back in Ball Blast Off? Well, if you go there again, it happens in every galaxy of where coconuts were. There is now watermelons. Yeah. Now there is watermelons. If you increase your starbit count, to the maximum, there will be watermelons. That's all I wanted to show you. But first, I just want to make this fun and just defeat this underground gunner once more. Wait for it. Now! Now he is mad. You missed by a, by a bald hair. Let's try this. Go! I missed. Trying to do this with a watermelon, I'm failing so badly. There I go, I defeated under Grunt Gunner. Now, I'm going to try to do head starts in the Cosmic Comet in orbit. I meant to say yes. And I'm actually going to go back out, talk to Meltone. I'm actually going to do this a fun way. The Luma just ruined it. I just walked. Look at those two following along with each other like brothers. Or as boyfriend and girlfriend Lumas, whatever. Oh, they- Ah, oh, I was hoping that would continue, but the Luma just left. Darn it. I just love that moment. So, 21 ups is what I need. And... Let's see if I can go ahead and do the head starts. And if I keep failing, I'll keep falling through the black hole. Which when I, which when I was playing when I was younger in Super Luigi Galaxy, I called the black hole the void because I didn't even know what it was called. Now I know it's called the black hole. How do I know, you may ask? Ah, darn it! Right when I was about to go to the mission, my Wii Remote died. 
Now I have to find another one. This is not going to be a cutscene, just enjoy my talking while it lasts for a little bit. <sighs> Can't believe that happened. Well, it won't last long. Anyways. Although this is on low battery as well, I'm going to try to do it. Honey Hive Cosmic Luigi Race. Let's try to do head starts. Hello, Cosmic Luigi. I'm back once again to try to do head starts. I did it too early. Blame me for this. That was entirely my fault. Ah, come on! I did it before! I know I'm telling the truth. You have to press Z and the right button, right when it's at 2, and as soon as it shows go, get a head, just press the, just flick the straight button. Yeah, I missed. Again, I did. Yeah, it may seem boring to you, but I'm just gonna keep trying until I succeed. Man, this is going on forever. Arg! I can do it better with Mario. I've never done it with Luigi. Well, I have. I had once. It's probably rare for me to try. That's why I'm trying it. I'm on! I did it before. Fine, I'm gonna try it with Mario. So. Let's see if I can do it with Mario. If I can't do it with Mario, then. All luck fails. I'm gonna try it with Mario no matter what. I'm gonna try it with Mario. It is possible to do it with Luigi, but I'm gonna try it with Mario, alright? So this is uh, like the original Super Mario Galaxy. This is Super Mario Galaxy now, even though that won't be... It would be a pretty long time. So go on the terrace, try the Cosmic Comet with Mario. It is not all possible with Mario, it is more possible than Luigi. Let's just try it, alright? Just want more fitness with Mario. Mario's a fat plumber, Luigi's skinny. I want Mario to get some... Great exercise, so he will be muscular and grab Bowser by the tail and fling him way up there in the sky. That's how I feel about Bowser, alright? Don't judge me. Hey! It's you, Shadow Mario from Super Mario Sunshine, even though you're in space. I failed with Mario, too. I know I can do it. Well, in the, la in the next part, I almost said in the last part, I'm gonna do some more head start tries, and if I fail, then I'm just gonna keep trying until the end. See you guys later, and maybe I might get game over, so I'm just gonna get this one up back here. See ya, goodbye!